um, Andrew has been has been really great as a as a colleague, as a friend, and as a as a as a as a manager that I've been reporting to in the last few months. Um, he has really made himself available to me whenever I've needed his input or or advice on anything that I'm that I'm working on. Uh, he's a very busy guy, so getting getting a hold of him <laughs> can be a bit difficult sometimes. But uh, when you've got his attention, you've got all of his attention, and he's going to give you everything that you need. He's also very much a a people person, so <laughs> he seems to know pretty much everyone in Vodacom. I don't. I have no idea how he gets that right, uh, <laughs> but I think it's something that that probably helps him get his get his work done as a manager to me he's he's been really he's been really great um it's it's almost difficult at times to to think of him as my superior uh because of the relationship that we that we have he's very open um what he has achieved is nothing short of phenomenal there was a system Siebel, that really had a, a bad reputation within the company. Um, I think there'd been two or three attempts to implement the application within Vodacom. Uh, I guess the fact that you have to try more than once means it failed uh, more than once. And Andrew pretty much drove the process to get Siebel implemented in various business areas and got people to adopt the application and uh, really see it as as the future of uh, of Vodacom in in certain respects so that has been really outstanding on his part Andrew winning the Vodafone Global Heroes Award uh, makes me feel um, I guess proud of him and also excited um, and I'd say a bit nervous as well um, as much as uh, as much as we like to recognize heroes um, I think a lot of people's achievements are team achievements and I sort of feel like Andrew receiving this award and the achievement being recognized is also a recognition of of our team's achievements and uh, I guess the nervousness comes in feeling like there might be a spotlight on us uh, increasing expectations and so on uh, but all in all we're happy uh, that Andrew has received the award. I'm very excited that Andrew has won the award. Andrew's a type of character that loves to make a difference and make an impact to Vodacom. Andrew has done a fantastic job in making a whole contribution beyond Vodacom but into the Vodafone family. There are two significant parts that he's contributed. The one part has to do with Vodacom generating a particular solution in the sales department and then offering it to the Vodafone UK and that's helped them tremendously because they've achieved a turnaround time twice as fast as they would normally have done. On the second part, Andrew's made a significant um, contribution beyond my division and to the whole of Vodacom. In the Oracle deal, he's, we've been able to achieve economies of scales and pricing working with Vodafone together in partnership. This has a tremendous impact in how we in the IT division can maintain and manage our costs. I am Andrew Detoy, I'm manager in the business consulting area working for Vodacom South Africa. No, I'm really excited. It's not every day that you get nominated for a Vodafone Global Euros Award uh, and to win it is a real honour. Um, I'm really looking forward to the prize as soon as they let me know what that is. Yeah, it's really awesome to know that Vodacom and Vodafone still recognise people for their valued contributions and I'd like to thank Anton Favreau and Glenn Ford for nominating me for this award and then of course the awards committee for actually giving it to me.